Police dogs in the valley are now getting new protection from drug overdoses. They're helping their handlers detect cheaper, more potent drugs these days, drugs that can do harm in a matter of moments. Fine. To canine K Joe, this is all fun and games. Oh, 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 Training exercises to find guns or drugs. Just one of the jobs this four legged crime fighter carries out on any given day. We work field patrol, we do apprehension work. Um, we're also used to search for explosives and ammunition. Deputy Todd Burke has worked with KJO for more than seven years. And in that time, the team has seen a lot of changes, especially when it comes to drugs on the streets. The fentanyl, um, even the opiates, um, weren't as likely eight years ago. We were dealing with a different type of narcotic. But um, obviously, the fentanyl is very popular right now, so we're seeing um, increase in exposure and um, coming across it. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, overdose deaths nationwide from opioids, including prescription opioids, heroin and fentanyl, have increased almost six times since 1999. Overdoses involving opioids killed more than 47,000 people nationwide in 2017. We could be doing a search anywhere and the dog could come across um, and be exposed to it. Signs of exposure in dogs can include immediate behavior change. They can become lethargic or even have trouble breathing. To counter any exposure, deputies now have these kits. The medication, known as naloxone, helps block the effects of the opioids almost immediately. The organization Canines of Valor donated 12 of these kits to the Fresno County Sheriff's Office, one for every canine officer. For this a uh, nonprofit group to send these kits means a lot to us because it's just that added safety for our, our dogs for the streets. The kits themselves cost around $75, but the peace of mind they provide is priceless to keep canine officers on the job to get the bad guys. Well, the Fresno County Sheriff's Office has nine canine officers working the field. Another three are assigned to work specifically on narcotics.